Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're back again with another vlog. Starting it off here in the car today. Oh, snaps. I like to be getting distracted. Um, yeah, so hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, we're starting the vlog off here. Run, ran some errands in the morning. We're headed right now to the shop. We're going to get some breakfast. We're getting some canes. In a while since we had some canes, so we're going to get some canyon combos. Sauces. I like the extra toast. I'm only gonna get the toast. I'm not. No chicken? No chicken? I am not. In the what box. about fries? You guys gotta Just fries eat chicken. Them. Just fries. Yeah, you guys gotta get some chicken. No. Mm -hmm. No, I'm hiding from the chicken. No. Just arrived to Cane's. We go order. ahead and order oh, all the okay. Hello, can I get two Cane combos? Sure, Can I get a uh, Coke's? Can I get both of them with no coleslaw, extra toast? No coleslaw, extra toast, okay. And uh, can I get two extra sauces? No. That's it. We're gonna find out right now, see what Kane's doing for the quarantine. COVID Who quarantine. Yeah. Me, Alex. Yeah, for a quarantine, there's a lot of people getting some Kane's. Gotta get that Alex. chicken. How much was it? Support small businesses. It was 27 Yay. something. Those pranks, look at they got canes. They have freaking um Thank you. Look, he has a wait, he's not he needs to come out. Look, he has a canes bandana. Yeah, they're handing out the food out here. Is everyone's wearing bandanas? They said fuck him, he gets to be outside of here. And after that car is out, if I can just have you pull forward to the coach. Awesome. Here, mommy. Oh, so they're making the car stay like separate right here. You see that one's way back there. Mommy here. Hold right, it. Well, one, two, three. Hold it. I can't. King's right, bandanas. So. Who wants some next level bandanas? They got, yeah, they got You guys king. want some for this COVID-19? We'll make some. Yeah, not sure what the I'll next level mask. Out. Go forward. Go forward. <laughs> to rob? They got all the straws and everything out here. Why did you say to rob? Freaks. Any ketchup for you today? Uh, no, thank you. Alright, here's your order. Let me get a napkin real quick. Sorry about that. Oh, sorry about that, yeah. Awesome, thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, man. Damn, we are packing today. Quick little story. Oh, yeah. This car's actually been involved in a hit and run. Nessa actually had to chase the uh, the other driver that hit her. So, as you can see here, we're in Santee, and there's a so it's a double turn there, and was she on was the on the outer lane, and the f car on the inside turned all the way out to the second lane and hit her, and then she drove off. They she they, they messed up the door, the quarter panel, which we just had fixed. Broke my Arnold. No, they bent my 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 wheels. Yeah. Pretty, pretty, I mean, it was a pretty hard hit. The car was still fine, could still drive and everything. She lifted but, us. Uh, yeah, Nessa had a chaser oh. like, I don't know, three lights down, two lights down to the, to, the, the to a uh, Lowe's or Home Depot that's down there. Yeah, because I just, I was like, you better pull over. And then she pulled over. It was a high schooler. What car were they in? With three other cars. I don't know, some fucking long car. It was a high schooler with three other, three other like students. They were down here from like Ellsmore. Nessa had to chase them down here, and then, um, yeah, so they exchanged information at, at the end. When we made the claim, she started claiming that Nessa hit her, and uh, so then nothing got done. So insurance didn't, like, do anything about it, so we had to fix it out of pocket. And, um, yeah, I had a, since I was parting my car at, at the time, we pretty much swapped my door over to this car's door, and then we just repaired the quarter panel. We got new wheels. What you doing back there, monkey? Sit that sit back, tie yourself in. I am tied in. She wants to be in the vlogs. But uh but yeah that happened to this car, so yeah, fun little story that um happened to Nessa. That was not fun. <laughs> 
uh, way to the shop. We'll see you guys once we get there. Get started on that GT500. Finish up that wrap. Um, yeah, excited. We're going to finish it this week, so stay tuned for that. It's going to be sick. First wrap GT500. Uh, Taken to the next level. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a good a good one. So you know you guys wanna make sure you guys watch that. Make sure you guys smash that like button. It really helps us out when you guys uh, like the videos and share them. If you guys can share them, subscribe. Um, yeah, subscribe. Turn on the notifications. That little bell. Um, the what? Comment down below. Oh yeah, you guys already know, huh? <laughs> what else, Sander? There you go. You guys heard him. <laughs> All right, guys. We'll see you guys at the shop. In the shop, just finished eating Arcania combo, and uh, yeah, it's really good for those of you that haven't tried uh, canes. Uh, we recently just tried it, I think, in the past year, and um, we liked it. So really nice that they made one because there, there's not too many of them. It's kind of like that In and Out thing where there's not too many In and Outs everywhere. Um, same thing with canes. There's not too many, at least here in the San Diego area. So um, yeah, we're here back in the shop. And check it out, we got the GT500 wheels back from powder coating. Take a look at them. done in matte black and uh, yeah it's gonna go ahead and tie the whole wrap together they were glossed before so now with the matte black we're gonna go ahead and uh, get the car down today we're gonna start with some of the matte black wrap which is gonna be the Avery matte black and uh, yeah Manny already started uh, uh, laying everything out putting the bumpers out side skirts uh, some other parts that we're also gonna be wrapping today uh, a lot of small parts I need to get wrapped so um, the front bumper parts are going to take some time to wrap, but uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and put the wheels on the GT500. That way we can get it off the lift now. And uh, yeah, start doing some of the wrap. Pinstripes, we got the stripes. Nessa got those cut out also. Check them out. So a lot of red touches, red, matte, black, matte, white, tying everything together. Super sick. Uh, it's going to be super unique GT500. To begin with, these cars are already unique. And uh, this one's gonna be definitely standing out from any other GT500 that is out there. At least for 2020 because right now with all this coronavirus, the production for these GT500s got slowed down uh, because Ford is now producing ventilators and stuff like that, you know, helping out with what's going on. So uh, this is gonna be a super unique GT500 and really honored to be, to have a chance to work on this and uh, yeah, have it here at the shop. you guys have it we got the GT500 down on the lift we're gonna go ahead and get started with doing the hood wrap so we already wiped the hood down and uh, we're gonna be wrapping this in the matte black so like I was telling you guys it's gonna be matte black hood matte black roof and matte black trunk and then for the matte black is not it, it so it's gonna be kind of going down towards the sides of the car so it's gonna go down to about this body line here on the fender so we gotta wrap this part of the fender, this this side up in the matte black along with the door and it's gonna go all the way up following this body line all the way to here and going down here. So all that needs to be rewrapped in the matte black. So uh, yeah, once we go ahead and do that, the hood's gonna be matte black, then we're, then we're gonna go ahead and lay a matte white stripe over the matte black and he's gonna have matte white in the center with a red pinstripe inside of the matte white. So right now it's kind of, probably kind of confusing, but uh, yeah, you guys are gonna see this come together probably today. Um, once we get these three panels wrapped in the matte black, it's gonna change up everything. So um, yeah, let's go ahead and get started with, uh, with, with the hood and uh, knock out the hood, roof and trunk.
have it guys we did the hood roof and trunk in matte black and check it out everything looks great coming along nicely the matte black and matte white just look so good together both it's a really nice combo and uh yeah we're not done with the matte black we still got to do the pillars in matte black going down towards the quarter panel doors the defender like i was telling you guys earlier so a lot more matte black is going to be installed still so yeah stay tuned for all that so yeah let's go ahead and have a quick little walk around show you guys the trunk this trunk is all nicely set roof also is all done and uh yeah right now we're getting started on the rear bumper so we're gonna knock out the rear bumper right now we got some inlays done so for these rear bumpers um this license plate area is a little tricky so um i have tried to lay a piece over this and do it on one piece but uh it's hit or miss sometimes you get to do it sometimes you can't um i guess it's just you know luck or depending you, you need a lot more practice to get this done in one piece and just have one inlay up here so uh just to make everything a lot easier we just lay an inlay on this inside and then a separate inlay in here so we have the seam that meets up here in this area um just a lot quicker to do it looks clean there you can't tell there's a seam there unless you really go and look at it so it's just much safer way to do it less risk of anything failing because we don't have to worry about stretching the vinyl into the license plate area but yeah check it out the rear bumper is done with the inlay so we're gonna go ahead and get started and laying one big piece here so yeah we're gonna go ahead and get started with that and as for the front bumper so we're gonna be doing the bumper in satin white pretty much the whole thing is gonna be done in satin white so we're gonna have these sides down here in satin white so it's two separate pieces here we're gonna get separated by a plastic here a gloss black plastic that we're gonna be doing in matte black also pretty tricky stuff I'll show you guys that right now but uh, yeah so we're gonna be doing this outer piece in matte white all of the center in matte white and then we're gonna be doing an inlay um, over the matte white in matte black so it's gonna be doing this inside piece right here this trim coming along this way and then going up into the hood so the front bumper is gonna tie in with the hood as for the matte black and then as you guys know there's a black insert here which is also going to be done in matte black and this lower portion is actually going to be left in the matte white so the customer wants to do leave this in matte white um and yeah that's going to be the same thing on this side so yeah everything is pretty much almost ready to go at least when it comes to the wrap just uh yeah we're going to finish up probably the bumpers today and then finish up laying up some of the matte black tomorrow. Little touches, pinstripes, start reassembly on Wednesday, most likely. And then, um, yeah, it's gonna be it for this one. This one's pretty much almost ready to go. We have until Saturday, but if we finish quicker, we'll go ahead and let the customer know that it's ready. We wanna do a whole whole media thing with this build. You know, this, these cars are super special, these GT500s. Like I was telling you guys, they're super limited right now. And yeah, having one of these in the shop is definitely super, super, super cool. And uh, yeah, we're really lucky to have it in here. So we're going to take advantage of it and get as much content as we can out of it. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get started on that rear bumper. And then uh, we'll jump over to the front bumper, see how much we can get done.
guys, there you have it. The rear bumper is all complete. We finished uh, wrapping pretty much the last of what's left for the car. We just have the front bumper tomorrow um, and all the little pieces that are going to be wrapped in matte black. So everything that was gloss black is going to matte black. So that is the spoiler. We got to remove this little wicker bill piece in the back. And then we have the mirror still actually to do. Door handles, gas cap, all those little things. And then for the hood scoop, we're gonna be doing all these little fins and in individual pieces, so check it out. Uh, super tedious and it's gonna take quite a while to do, but it's gonna be some fun video to go ahead and do. And then we also have these front bumper pieces which go on this side area here that we're also gonna be doing in matte black. So yeah, everything's gonna be going matte black. So these go here just like this and this is all going to be wrapped so a lot of little details a lot of little uh tucking that needs to be done tucking trimming inlay stuff like that so this is probably gonna take longer than the bumpers but um yeah after that we have the bumper insert which we have over here so this one right here the one that's right in the center of the bumper also gloss black going in matte black pretty quick just a flat piece and uh, we'll go ahead and knock it out pretty quick but yeah that's gonna be it for today um hope you guys are enjoying the video this gt500 is coming along super nice um hope you guys are enjoying watching the process from beginning to end i don't really show too much too much diys we've done actually so this is a 2018 rear bumper so if you guys are looking for a a uh, DIY on uh, the rear bumper we actually have a video up already on YouTube on our YouTube channel so I'll go ahead and leave a link in the description to that um, it's a more in-depth video on laying the inlays and all that stuff doing the whole bumper piece by piece so I'll go ahead and leave the link to that bumper in the description below so it's the same thing 2018 bumper and uh, yeah that's gonna be pretty much it we oh yeah we also did the side skirt so side just came out super nice both of them are all done, ready to go. Um, yeah, we just gotta put them on the car, but oh um, yeah, the car's looking great. And uh, yeah, we're happy with it. Everything's looking super nice. So we're gonna go ahead and put the car up on the lift, move everything underneath, bring the cars in. And uh, yeah, close up shop for today. Make sure to leave a like, comment down below, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace. Hey.